The telltale common symptoms of COVID-19, such as dry cough, fever and tiredness, and what led this woman to the hospital. I went up to the hospital the Thursday morning because my, my eyes was um, going a little dark. So I went up there and um, after I was up there, you know, and they said I have um, pneumonia. So then I came from the hospital the Monday. The Tuesday afternoon, anything after three, I received a phone call. Over the phone, the woman was told she had COVID-19. So I said, have the COVID. Where I pick up that, I don't go any place. So I don't have no COVID. They say yes. So uh, And they sent in the ambulance for me and the ambulance came and picked up the Tuesday afternoon. She says her first time at the hospital, all that was taken was a blood test and an x-ray. But after returning, a sample was taken that proved she had COVID-19. I wasn't feeling any kind of sickness. I didn't have no kind of symptoms, not, nothing. So I was um, surprised. However, the woman is a part of a high-risk group, being a diabetic and hypertensive, and was hospitalized for two weeks. Meanwhile, her family of 10 had to be quarantined after her diagnosis. My family was uh, at um, Hawksville, and they are negative. The woman who is now home thanks workers at the Mount St. John's Medical Center for their care during her illness. I would like to um, thank the nurses and the doctors. They were very um, good to me, especially nurse... Um, Robert, Nurse Ross, and a few more nurses. I don't remember the name, but they were very much good to me. Jessica Russell, ABS News.